Can you use ChatGPT on your phone? Absolutely yes, and there are two primary ways to do it, either through the official mobile app for iOS or Android, or through your mobile web browser, and we'll walk through both. So OpenAI has launched dedicated mobile apps for both iOS and Android, and both of the apps are free and come with features like syncing your chat history across devices, so you can start a chat on your laptop and pick it up on your mobile phone. And it also has voice input, similar to Siri, so you can talk out out loud, ask your questions to ChatGPT in a more conversational way. So download the mobile app, open up the app store on your phone, and then search OpenAI ChatGPT. And it should look like this. So I've pulled up the website, but you'll see pretty much the same thing on your phone. And it should say it's by OpenAI. This is really important because there's a bunch of copycat scam apps that force you to pay extra. So make sure you're downloading ChatGPT, this is what the logo looks like, the official app by OpenAI. It's released by OpenAI and has over a million ratings. Similarly, on the Android store, it pretty much looks the same. Like this is the logo. Make sure it's from OpenAI. And this one has like 3.6 million reviews. So just make sure you're downloading the correct app and not a copycat scam app. And once you've installed the app, go ahead and log in and then open the app. And it should look something like this. I put it in dark mode just so you can see it a little better when I'm filming. And all you have to do is type a message here, just like you're chatting with a friend or like sending a WhatsApp message. And you can go ahead and start a voice chat by clicking the headphones here in the corner. I'm gonna go ahead and try that. Click the headphone icon. Okay, and then it's gonna say connecting and open up a voice input. And I'm gonna say, can I use ChatGPT on my phone? And here it's thinking, yes, it's thinking. you can definitely use ChatGPT on your phone. You can access it through a mobile browser or by downloading the ChatGPT app for iOS or Android depending on your phone. Do you need help with setting that up? Okay, and then click X to X out. And what's really cool is you can see the entire voice chat history. So you can ask multiple questions back and forth. And then let's say you stop the voice chat, you can keep asking questions within the same conversation by typing it out down here at the bottom. And then if you click the on the upper left corner, you can see all of the past conversations that you've had over here. A really handy way to keep using ChatGPT while you're on the go and you have access to your previous conversation so you can continue where you left off. So that's one option to use ChatGPT on your phone. The second option is to use it through your mobile web browser. So to do that, open your mobile browser. The default is Safari, but I personally use Google Chrome, downloaded it on my iPhone, and just go to chatgpt.com on your mobile phone. And it will look, again, something like this, the familiar ChatGPT interface. You can go ahead and log in there and start using ChatGPT. And this mobile web version still provides most of the features that you need, just doesn't have like voice input, for example, that the mobile app does. So the short answer is yes, you can absolutely use ChatGPT on your phone and it's super handy for quick answers. You can use it for productivity if you need to brainstorm things or jot down different ideas you have, draft a quick email. And today we covered the two options to do that. So the mobile app or the mobile web browser. And again, for the mobile app, just make sure you're using the official mobile app from OpenAI and not one of the other kind of scam apps that make you pay extra.